Uh, so this isn't the first time this board has had to deal with the issue of naming in a way that they were not uh, unified. If we do vote to change the name, uh, we had a discussion of process at the last meeting. Um, there were several who indicated that because we've not yet voted on whether or not to change the name, that uh, a discussion of the process would be moved. So I really don't know how the whole board um, feels. We discussed at the last meeting several options. A board-centric process where we adjust the policy to include more types of names than our current policy allows. We solicit input from the public on uh, that policy and then solicit names against that policy and narrow it down. Uh, we could have a process similar to the strategic plan where we had roundtables of community members who engaged in the process in a facilitated and controlled way to work through a series of questions that could inform us on uh, names. Um, and then the third was, um, if I remember back to the last people with the third was a, um, well, let's just leave it at those two then. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So that's, I mean, that's, um, Reverend Mason, that's my personal opinion. Um, it was, if there is a vote to change, if we do move forward, um, I, I would seek counsel from board members and from community members. I would uh, hope to lay out in a public meeting a process that was deliberate and thoughtful, but yet not so long that it would continue any extra division or distraction. Um, so I, I, that's, those are my thoughts on it. If we decide to change, that we have a process to iron out. Have in talking about costs with members of the community indicated a, a desire to be very flexible on the timeline of implementation uh, to be able to minimize or to almost eliminate the cost of conversion. Um, that would be something that the board would also need to weigh in on should we choose to move forward is the methodology and timing of conversion uh, so that we can give the superintendent and his team the guidance they would need to uh, roll out a plan. But I'm open to other comments or suggestions from board members about um, a way forward after tonight, uh, based on either outcome. I say we don't put the cart too far ahead of the horse and take it one step at a time. Okay. Does anybody else want to respond to Rithia's question? I think we all have an idea. other discussion? If not, then I would entertain a motion. So I move we change the name of Robert E. Lee High School and develop a process for renaming. Okay, there's been a motion. Is there a second? closure, um, although permitted to second a motion uh, as president to preside neutrally over these functions, I would choose not to. Um, I would ask that remind members that seconding a motion does not indicate that you support it. It only indicates that it will be brought to a vote and that the whole reason it was on the agenda tonight was that at least five members ask that we bring this to a vote so that we can provide closure on it. So is there a second for the motion? If not, then the motion fails. Say again, Mr. Harding. 
Did you say something? I did not. Okay. Are there any other motions before the board? Okay, that concludes this item. The next item on our agenda is executive.